I am standing at the bottom end of Devonport Park overlooking the dockyard and down at where the road turns sharp 90 degree angle there that was the dockyard gate the famous dockyard gate and that's where the memorial to the Polish Navy World War II was once situated before it went to the Belvedere and in September 1939 three Polish destroyers and a supply vessel arrived here in Devonport and in September the same year first sea lord Winston Churchill visited the Polish ships and the seamen and there were photographs of him inspecting the crews etc etc and that was before 1940 when he became Prime Minister and in December 1939 the King came down to meet the Polish cadets, naval cadets. So you can see why the Polish Naval HQ is at the top of Albert Road, because the Polish warships World War II were there. So it's just up the hill, isn't it? Yes. In fact, you can just about almost see it, I'd have thought. It's hidden up there, couldn't you? It's yes. just about there. In 1944, for D-Day, six Polish manned warships left Devonport. They were even uh, given a light World War I cruiser and that cruiser actually was sunk at the beachhead at D-Day but the other destroyers survived and also Polish small warships helped defeat uh, in a small battle around the corner um, going west to stop supply vessels attacking uh, the landings. So this was a very important job which the Polish Navy had to do and they did it very well, but they lost the light cruiser. That's why in researching my birth families, I discovered all this information and indeed wrote a book called Poles Apart. Polish Naval Memories of World War II. Incredible stories some.